All right. Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning. Sure. All right. Nice to see you. Oh, look at our TK and our kindergartners doing such a great job. I'm so proud of you. You're sitting crisscross applesauce. Good job. You're keeping your hands in your basket. You're looking at me, which is good. And you're being a good listener, I can tell. Excellent. So we are excited. Because today we have lots of awards. It's our Student of the Trimester, Student of the Year, Readathon Awards, we have perfect attendance. We got lots and lots of awards that we're going to get to. But before we do that, I want to just welcome everybody. Good morning. Thank you for being with us. And then I also want to introduce to you for a fun performance this morning our BBS cheerleaders. Over here, 
and you're going to get your medal. They're going to give you a medal. And so they're going to put it over your head. Okay? And then I'm not going to do it right now. After you get your medal, then you're going to walk over here. You're the very first person. Right here, there's a purple X. That X marks the spot. Okay, so you're going to stand here with your certificate and your medal around you, and you're going to look out at the audience over there. If you're getting a Student of the Year award, not only are you going to get a medal, you're also going to get a trophy, too. So if you're a Student of the Year winner, you get to get a trophy as well. So we are excited to pass out all of these different medals and all of these different things to all of our students. All right, we're gonna get started. Like I said, we have lots of names and I can hardly wait. Oh, before I do that, I have to do one more welcome to our families who are watching us on Zoom. Good morning, parents, pardon me, those that are watching on our YouTube channel. Thank you for being here with us this morning. We're glad that you can join us for our the trimester student of the year. We're glad that you can be a part of it. And again, all of our parents that are here, thank you for being a part of our students' assembly. You being here makes such a big difference because it lets our students know that education is important and we want them to continue to grow no matter if they're in kindergarten or all the way up into high school and hopefully into college. Buenos dias, mi nombre es Dr. Juan, yo soy el director de la escuela. Muchas gracias, thank you for being here. Again, I'm Dr. Juan, the principal, thank you for being here today. All right, here we go. We're going to start with Perfect Attendance Awards. For these awards, remember, we're going to call your name. Come on up. We have, in TK and kindergarten, we have four students that had perfect attendance. They were here every single day during the year. And when you're here at school learning, then you are doing a great job. That's why we want to be here every day, so we learn, learn, and learn. All right, in Mr. Costa's class, come on up when I call your name. Perfect attendance for this last third trimester, the last 60 days. Way to go, Juan Pablo Gonzalez. Another student from Mr. Costa's class, perfect attendance this trimester. Way to go, Mia Gonzalez Rodriguez. The next student, also I told the attendance of Mr. Postman's class, way to go, Diego Orozco. <laughs> and this next student from Ms. Contreras class, not only did she have perfect attendance for this trimester, she had perfect attendance for the entire year, all 180 days. So that's amazing. So this student, not only is she going to get a medal and the certificate, but she's going to get a trophy too because she had perfect attendance all year long. Way to go from Miss Contreras class, Lisa Romero. All right, awesome job. So she's going to come on up and get her goodies. And then our other students that are standing here, we'll make sure that we have our Certificates, we're looking good. Let's come this way just a little bit. So we're right in the middle with the balloons here. There we go. And then as soon as she gets her things, then we'll get our photo. Dual language 
class in kindergarten. She's in room K4. Nice round of class four. Miss Carasales. All right, now again with our readathon, some of our students are, they met their goal for the readathon. Some even exceeded their goal. And so we have some students that are going to get a medal and their certificate. We have others that are going to get a medal, certificate, and, and a trophy as well. So I'm going to be starting with those that just met their goal and are not going to be receiving the trophy. We'll do the ones that are receiving their trophies at the end of the group. So there were two students in Mr. Costa's class that are going to get the trophy, but I'm going to read them last so we can, I can see who it is. All right, first student that did a great job for Mr. Costa's class, read a thon. Come on up, all these students, when I call your name. First student, Alexa Benales. Another great readathon, Jonathan Lemus. Another excellent readathon student, Sebastian Pina. Another readathon, Joelle Madrena. Isabella Beltran. Mackenzie Partida. Viene Gonzalez, Camila Sanchez, Juan Pablo Gonzalez, Jose Zavala, Isaac Sanchez, Fabian Villalobos, Teresa Gomez, Alexander Sanchez and Gael Espejo. All right, so these students right here, they did an awesome job with their reading on meeting their goal. But again, like I said, we have two students who exceeded their goal and they're going to get a trophy because they got so many readathon points. So let's see who these two students are. This first student did an awesome job, is getting a top reader trophy. Way to go, Diego Orozco. <laughs> the next student also did an amazing job and is going to get a top reader trophy as well. Way to go, Guadalupe Lupita Cruz. So all of these students did a fantastic job with their readathon. They got all their points and they did everything that they should do. So as soon as all of them get their goodies, we'll have them lined up so that we can get our photo of them. So I was supposed to join your class. And then we'll have our students smiling, looking for the people taking their pictures. Good job. All right, let's give one more big round of applause for our students. Class. 
All right, let's see who's going to be a winner from this class for the readathon. First person met his goal. Way to go, Nathan Aguirre. Way to go, Alexia Beltran. Awesome job, Taylor Gonzalez. Another great reader, Ruben Martinez. Another excellent reader, way to go, Aiden Mascoro. Another great reader, Angel Mendez. Super reading, Santiago Ramos. Excellent job, Kevin Reyes. Another great reader, Maribel Robles. And another great reader, Moses Santana. All right, so again, these students, they met their goal on the readathon, and now we're going to find out who our winners are that are going to get the trophies for doing a super job. All right, this first student did a great job exceeding the goal. Top reader trophy, way to go, Hector De La Torre. The next student also did a great job as a top reader is getting a trophy, way to go, Ivan Villafana. So again, all the students from this class did a great job getting their awards, and they did an awesome job with their reading. All right, so then we'll have Ms. Carasales.
Again, we have one more student in this class that exceeded her goal and did an awesome job. So she's going to get a trophy in addition to the medal and certificate. So this student is a top reader, winner, way to go, Ariel Garcia. Ariel, our boy, come on up, sir, and sit down. Now. 
All right, we're going to call the teachers again to come up to give their items away to their students again. We're going to have Ms. Acosta and Show, please come back on up. And we'll also have Ms. Carasada. Let's give a nice round of applause to Ms. Carasada and Ms. Acosta. All right, so again, we're going to be giving awards for student of the trimester and also student of the year. So if you're a student of the trimester winner, you're going to again be getting a certificate and medal. But if you're a student of the year winner, you're going to be getting a trophy too. So we're going to introduce all of our student of the trimester winners first, and then we'll introduce our student of the year winners after that. All right, student of the trimester winners from Miss Acosta's class in academics. Way to go. Viene Gonzalez. Another great student with academics. Way to go, Camila Sanchez. The next student got an award for citizenship. Way to go, Diego Orozco. Another great student with family citizenship. Way to go, Fabian Villalobos. These next students were avid winners. That means that they did neat work and were organized. Way to go, Penelope Cruz Pena. And another great avid student. Way to go, Cesare Montes. All right, now we're going to introduce our student of the year winners. That means, again, they had to do a great job all year long. 180 days, and that's a long time. So this student did a great job in academics. Student of the Year winner, Joel Madueña. <laughs> the next student also did a great job with citizenship all year long. Way to go, Mackenzie Partida. <laughs> and the next student did a great job with having strategies all year long to be neat. Way to go, Camila Sanchez. So again, all of these students did a super job all year long, and we're very proud of them for everything that they did during the entire school year. Robles. Another 
Another great student with super citizenship all trimester. Way to go, Ruben Martinez. Another student that was neat and organized with avid strategies. Way to go, Nathan Aguirre Orozco. The next student was also neat and organized. Way to go, Ian Ibanez Navarro. All right, these next students were Student of the Year winners again all year long. They had to do a great job. This first one's in academics. Way to go, Hector De La Torre Calderon. This next student also in citizenship all year long. Did an amazing job. Way to go, Ivan Villafana. Another amazing year pet with Avid all year long. Way to go, Aiden Masforo. So again, all of these students work very hard, whether it be for the trimester or whether it's the entire year, they did an awesome job. <coughs> All right, as soon as they get their awards, I'll Ms. Marsalis join them.
Well, I guess Contreras, join your students. With the paparazzi. All right, let's give a warm round of applause for our students. We're going to go first as we're going to get this one. And going on, guys, we're going to get this one. Excellent job. Keep it up. All the same. Midcast. All right, great job. All right, we have two more teachers. Let's see who their winners are. We're going to go to K3 with Miss Soria. So we're going to call up the students first. I did a great job with with academics this trimester. Way to go, Asaria Herrera. The next student did a great job also with academics. Way to go, Jacob Rubokaba. The next student did a great job with citizenship this trimester. Way to go, Liliana Rodriguez. Then next student also did a great job with citizenship. Way to go, Daniel Figueroa. The next student also did a great job with Avid Strategies. Way to go, Alec Guadalupe Reynal Dominguez. The next student also did a great job with Avid this trimester. Way to go, Gilberto Felix. These next three students are Student of the Year winners, which means, again, they did a great job all year long. Student of the Year for Academics, way to go, Domingo Guayama. The next Student of the Year did a great job with Citizenship, way to go, Darilia Baldenbro. The next student also did a great job with added strategies this whole year. Way to go, Carlos Anthony Perez. All right, so as soon as they all get their awards, their trophies, their certificates, their medals, we'll have the podium joining the students where we can get a photo. <coughs> All right, good job. Let's give one more big round of applause for our students from K3. Let's give them a round of applause. 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 In K1 for Ms. Holguin's class, let's interview, interview Steve's students that did an amazing job again during the trimester or during the whole year. First students did a great job with academics this trimester. Way to go, Juliet Mejia. The next student also did a great job with academics. Way to go, Ariana Luna. A super citizen this trimester. Way to go, Caroline Guevara Figueroa. The next student did a great job also with citizenship. Way to go, Athena Garcia. This student did a great job with added strategies, doing nice and neat work. Way to go, Melanie Oriana. This next student also did a great job with Avid. Way to go, Sheila Romero. The next students are Student of the Year winners in these categories. The first one, Academics, Student of the Year. Way to go, Theodore Zaragoza. The next Student of the Year winner in Citizenship. Way to go, Abdiel Galvez. And our last Student of the Year winner in kindergarten this year in Avid. Way to go, Isabella Prieto. So way to go, all of you boys and girls that are working so hard this year, this semester, all these times. Amazing work. So as soon as they all get their goodies, we'll have Ms. Hogan join her class. 
and then we'll have the paparazzi get their last photo off, and then we will be ready to adjourn. All right, let's give one more big round of applause. Amazing new guest, new guest is awesome. Way to go. Ooh, that was a lot of awards. I think that's the most awards we've ever given, ever, ever here at Valley Hill School. That was so many. But what does that tell me? It tells me you were working hard this year, and you were recognized for doing an amazing job. You know what I forgot? I can't believe it, I forgot. Did you guys notice what's behind me? Something different, something different. I forgot to tell us, it says, you are unstoppable. That means you can just go, 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 and people can't stop you, you can do it. It's like our mighty meerkat. He's unstoppable, just like you're unstoppable. You guys can do whatever you want. When we look up here, what do I see right here? This looks like a ball, right? This looks like the sun. This looks like a book. This looks like a apple. And this looks like a star. All those things, because we can do all these things. These are all the things that you are starting to learn in kindergarten about and doing a great job. So I just wanted to point that out before we went today. All right, parents, thank you for coming today. We're glad that you're here. We'll see you in a few days because we're going to see you again for our kingdom promotion. So we look forward to that. Boys and girls, whoa, 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 whoa. That's so fast. I know you're eager, but I want our parents to hear this too, so we got to do it. I just wanted to thank them first. And then I wanted to say thank you, boys and girls, for working hard and doing all the great job. Let's give our teachers a round of applause and their parent educators for working hard for their students. This year, all the Boys and girls, I don't believe I want to hear us nice and loud so our parents know. Ready? I'm going to say it. I want you guys to say it really loud. Here we go. Before we do, parents, thanks for coming. Meerkats! Have a great night, everybody. Thank you for coming. Oh, and I forgot, punch and cookies outside. If you, get, if you got an award, you get to go get punch and cookies with your parents as long as you give your teachers permission. Thanks again for coming. Have a great rest of the day.
event party. So I apologize for that. We just had so many awards for our kindergarten students, we just had to give them all out. And so it took a little bit longer than we anticipated. So I, again, I apologize, but thank you for your patience. You guys did a really good job. So parents, thank you for being here today for our student of the trimester, student of the year. And we're also giving other awards for our readathon and the perfect attendance as well. But before we get to any of that, we have a little surprise. Let's give a nice round of applause for the BBS cheerleaders. Teachers asking you to do. 
So we have students that had perfect attendance for the last trimester, the last 60 days. We also had a student that had perfect attendance for the whole year. So we want to acknowledge these students. The first students we're going to introduce are students that had perfect attendance for the third trimester. When we're all done introducing those students, then we're going to introduce the student that had perfect attendance all year. All right, here we go. Perfect attendance. When I call you up, walk up here, and you're going to get your certificate from Miss Hare, and you're going to get a medal over here. Here we go. For Miss Bautista's class, perfect attendance. Way to go, Jasmine Gallardo Vargas. Also, perfect attendance this trimester, Gerardo Gonzalez. Another student, perfect attendance this trimester, Mateo Isidoro. Another perfect attendance, Mia Lara Astorga. Another perfect attendance, Claudio Rivera Garcia. From Miss Boss class, these students had perfect attendance. Way to go, Alberto Arrojo. And this student also had perfect attendance for this trimester, Alejandro De Leon. So these students had perfect attendance for this trimester, but there's one student up here who also had perfect attendance for the entire year. So we want to acknowledge that student too. So when I call this student's name, he's going to turn around and he's going to get his student of the year award. So this student, perfect attendance for the entire year. Way to go, Alejandro De Leon. So he also gets a trophy as well for having perfect attendance. So that is so hard to do. Again, it's hard to have perfect attendance for a trimester, but to have it for the whole year, that is very hard. So everybody smile out there for the moms and dads and families. All right, let's give one more big round of applause to our students with perfect attendance. Awesome job. Go ahead and give me a fist pump. Go on back to your seat. And let's see our next winners. Great job. Great job. Very, very good job. All right. We're going to also do now, we're going to do our readathon winners. So, with the readathon, these students had reading goals, they were able to meet all their goals, and some of them even exceeded them, and so they're going to get trophies too. So we're going to call up some teachers that are going to come up, and then we're going to introduce the students from their classes. So the first teacher we're going to call up, she is our dual language teacher, she's in room one. Oh, two. Nice round of applause for Miss Bautista. The next teacher that we want to introduce, she is today covering for our teacher who's in room 103. Nice round of applause for Miss Serrato, who's covering for Miss Presenio today. All right, we're going to have these students come on up. If I call your name, you come up and get your certificate. And you're also going to get a medal for doing a great job with the readathon, meeting your goal. All right, for Ms. Bautista's class, met her goal. Way to go, Leslie Pada. The next student, awesome job with the readathon, Moises Camacho. The next student, amazing work, way to go, Naomi Espinosa Lopez. Another great student with the readathon, Gerardo Gonzalez. And the last student from her class that met the goal, way to go, Kimberly Perez. So again, all these boys and girls met their goal with the readathon, did a super job. So as soon as they all get their certificates, we'll have Ms. Bautista stand behind them so we can get a photo.
All right, let's give a big round of applause again for our students from the Scott Jesus class in the Green Club. Can you be at this club? Can you be at this club and go in back to your seat? Excellent job, keep it up. All right, now we're gonna introduce the students from Miss Brisenio's class presented by Miss Sorato. So this first student, again, met the goal on the readathon. Excellent job. Way to go, Analia Cortez. All right, the next student did a great job also with the readathon. Way to go, David Gonzalez. The next student also did a great job this year at the readathon. Way to go, Liam Tellez Nunez. And the next student also did a great job with the readathon. Way to go, Mateo Cisneros. All right, so all of these students again did a super job meeting their goal and being amazing meerkats. So we're very proud of them. So we'll have Miss Serrato stand behind them as soon as they all get their goodies. And then. We will have our photo group take some photos. All right, let's give a round of applause to our students from Mr. Sandler's class. That's what we got. Way to go. All right, now we're going to introduce two more teachers to come up. And we want to then, and after that, we want to introduce their students. First teacher is our grade level lead for first grade this year. She's in room one. Oh, five, nice round of applause for Mrs. Boss. The next teacher we want to call up, she was part of our migrant at the school. She is in room one. Oh, four, nice round of applause for Mrs. Villanueva. All right, here we go for Mrs. Boss class. Met their goal in the readathon. Congratulations, Andre Ruiz Tovar. The next student, awesome job. Way to go, Kaylee Ramos Magana. The next student, way to go, Amelia Mendoza. Another great reader, way to go, Oliver Cruz Torres. And the last student from Miss Boss Class, way to go, Delilah Valenzuela. So excellent job to those boys and girls for reaching their goal on the readathon. Excellent work. Let his boss join them. All right, let's give a nice round of applause to our students from this last class. Great job for joining us this cup. And go on back to your seat. Excellent job. All right, we have one more class to introduce with their readathon. Let's see who these students are. There were quite a few students that are going to be getting awards from this class. So we might need to break it into two. Let's see how we do. And there's one student that got over 100 points and so is going to get a trophy for doing an excellent job with their reading, too. All right, here we go. We're going to introduce all the others first that met their goal. Way to go, Dulce Herrera Gutierrez. The next two, way to go, Elena Lopez Zaragoza. Another great reader, way to go. Aliana Figueroa. Another great job. Way to go, Sophie Pimentel. Another great job, Isabella Oriana Vargas. Another great job reading. Way to go, Iker Alfaro. Another super job. Way to go, Rafael Ramirez Diaz. Another great reader, way to go, Alexander Lopez. Another amazing meerkat with reading, way to go, Kalani Martinez. The next thing, also did a great job with reading, way to go, Aitana Acosta Valdez. The 
And next to him, also did a great job on the reading. Way to go, Isaac Jimenez. And the next to him, also did a great job with reading. Way to go, Alejandro Gasca. Another great student that did great reading. Way to go, Art Isaac Garcia. The next student that did a great job with reading. Way to go, Jackson Casares. Another great reader. Way to go, Zoe Tepete Zuniga. Another great reader. Way to go, Eric Ortiz Reyes. Another great meerkat, way to go, Santiago Camacho Aguilera. All right, as soon as they all come up here, we have one more student we want to introduce because this student was, again, not only a student that met the reading goal, but they also got over 100 points. So this student is a superstar reader. And because of that, that person is going to get a trophy. So this student, when I call your name, come on up for being a super reader who is getting a trophy. With 118 AR points, way to go, Darian Zasweta. All right, so great job to each of you. For doing an awesome job on your readathon. That again is very difficult to read, 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 and then be able to take quizzes and pass them. So that's what makes it a very challenging goal, is because they have to read and then test their comprehension as well. Well, it looks like we barely fit up here, but we're able to get them all up here. We'll have Stephen Webb join her class, and then we'll have the paparazzi get some shots in. All right, excellent job. Let's give one more big round of applause to all of our students from this class. And you at this point, and then go on back to your class. Awesome job. Keep up the great work. Amazing new kids. You are doing a super job. Keep it up. All right, you did it. You did it. All right, we have a few students from this class that are making their way down, but as soon as they do get on down, we're going to call up our teachers again to pass out some of the awards to their students. So the first teacher we're going to call back up again is in room 105. Come back up to the stage, Mrs. Boss. Then we'll also call up from 103, we'll call up Ms. Presenio's class, Ms. Serato, for today. Come on up. All right, now again, these are our student of the trimester and student of the year awards. For student of the trimester, that means that you did a great job for the last 60 days, which is great. But student of the year means you did it for the whole year, 180 days, and that is tough to do. All right, we're going to start with Mrs. Boss class. Let's see who our winners are from that class. The first student in academics this trimester, way to go, Celeste Corona. The next student also did a great job with academics, way to go, Amelia Mendoza. The next student did a great job with citizenship, way to go, Dorian Aguilar. The next student also did a great job with citizenship this trimester. Way to go, Dylan Galvin. The next student also did a great job with Abbott being neat and organized. Way to go, Nicholas Ordorica. Another great Abbott student this trimester. Way to go, Jimena Baltran Galvin. 
All right, so these next three students I'm going to call, they are Student of the Year winners, which means that they're going to get a trophy too. So again, Student of the Year for academics all year long. Way to go, Oliver Cruz Torres. The next student, Student of the Year in citizenship this year. Way to go, Amanda Lopez. And the last student of the year from this class in Avid. Way to go, Marlette Torres. So excellent job to again all these students, either for the trimester or for the year, for working very hard and doing great work. We'll have this class join them. All right, let's give one more big round of applause for our students in this class class. And we have this one. We have this one. We go all the time to your seat. Excellent job. Keep it up. Amazing. Near Kent. Way to go. Good job. All right. Excellent work. Excellent work. All right, let's find out now who are our students from Mr. Crescendo's class. These students did a great job this trimester. The first student did a great job in academics. Way to go, Santiago Cordoba. The next student also did a great job in academics this trimester. Way to go, Emiliano Camargo. The next student did a great job with citizenship, being a friend to others. Way to go, Christopher Silva. The next student also was an amazing meerkat this trimester in citizenship. Way to go, Priscilla Garcia. The next student did a great job with avid strategies this trimester. Way to go, Cesar Armenta. And this student also did a great job with avid this trimester. Way to go, Emily Mosqueda. All right, these last three students are Student of the Year winners. Let's see who they are, because they're going to get a trophy too. Student of the Year winner all year long in academics. Way to go, Sebastian Martinez. The next student was an amazing citizen all year long. Way to go, Allison Medivar. And the last student from this class that had great avid neat strategies all year long. Way to go, Darlene Zuniga. So again, super job to each of these boys and girls for working hard this trimester and then also working hard this year as well. So we'll have Ms. Sorrento join the class as soon as they all get their goodies. All right, let's give one more big round of applause to our students from Mr. Samuels, presented by Mr. Rocco today. Excellent job. Keep it up. Way to go. All right, we only have two more classes to recognize, so let's see who they are. The first teacher we're going to call back up. Again, she's our cool language teacher. She's from 102. Please come back up to the stage, Miss Bautista. And we're also going to call back up to the stage our teacher who's in room 104. Come on up, Miss Villanueva. All right, we're going to call up the students that had amazing work this last trimester. From Ms. Bautista's class in academics this trimester, way to go, Nicole Miranda Bayo. The next student that we want to call up did a great job again academically this trimester, way to go, Moises Camacho Andrade. 
Then our next student did a great job with citizenship this trimester. Way to go, Oscar Lemus. Then our next student also did a great job with citizenship this trimester. Way to go, Mateo Isidoro. This next student did a great job with avid strategies. Way to go, Naomi Espinosa. And the next student that we want to call up again for Avid Strategies, way to go, Noemi Espinosa. All right, and now we're going to introduce our Student of the Year winners. Again, all year long, did a great job in academics. Way to go, Giovanna Ramirez. The next student also did a great job in citizenship all year long. Way to go, Pippelin Perez. And the last student of the year from this class was an avid. Way to go, Brian Arturo Nunez. So again, amazing work by these students all year long in this trimester as well. All right, we'll have Ms. Bautista join her class. All right, let's give one more big round of applause for our students of Ms. Bautista's class. Excellent job. And you make this one and go on back to your seat. Amazing, Meerkat, way to go. Awesome. All right, we have one more class to do. And that's Miss Vienna Webb's class. Let's see who they are, our winners. I can hardly wait. All right, academics from Miss Vienna Webb's class this past trimester. Awesome job. Way to go, Pelani Martinez. The next student did a great job in academics this trimester. Way to go, Jackson Passetti. The next student did a great job in citizenship this trimester. Way to go, Isman Lopez. The next student also did a great job with citizenship this trimester. Way to go, Dulce Herrera. In added strategies, these students did an awesome job this trimester. Way to go, Eric Ortiz. And the last student that did a great job this trimester who's being recognized. Way to go, in added Rafael Ramirez. All right, so they did a great job this trimester. These next students again, student of the year winners all year long. The student did a great job in academics from the first day of school all the way to now. Way to go, Aliana Figueroa. This next student also did a great job in citizenship all year long. Way to go, Alina Lopez. And the last student of the year from this class was using great habit strategies. Way to go, Darianza Suerta. So again, amazing work by these students. They worked hard, did a great job, and we're very, very proud of them. Let's get off the We'll have this new woman join up for our last paparazzi opportunity. All right, let's give them one more big round of applause for our students from this new Awesome here, thanks. All right, we did it. That was a lot of awards again. I'm so proud of each and every one of you for working so very hard this year. Excellent job. All right, I have just a couple more things I want to say, and then we're going to dismiss you. 
with your teachers. First of all, I want to thank our parents. Parents, thank you for being here today again. It takes all of us to educate your students, and you being here shows that you are invested in your students' education, and you want to celebrate all the great things that they do. Let boys and girls, let's give our teachers a big round of applause for working so hard and doing such a great job with you this year. To all of our teachers, they did a great job. And then I want to say one thing before we go. Let's see. Let's see this. Let's see. If you are a winner today, guess what? You, with your teacher's permission, get to go outside or punching cookies out there. So if your teacher says you can, you can go outside with your family to go get punching cookies. All right, as we go, I want to hear us say nice and loud so our parents know that we know this. You guys ready? Here we go, and then we're going to say goodbye. Thanks again, parents, for being here. Here we go. Meerkats! Have a great day, everybody. Thank you.
Good morning, boys and girls. I know uh, you guys are just sitting quiet and just like I want you to. So I appreciate you doing a good job already when you're coming here. But good morning, good to see you. Hi, parents, thank you for coming to our student of the trimester. First of all, I want to apologize again for starting a little late, but we've had so many awards this morning that we've had to do that we've been running a little tardy. So I always ask our boys and girls to be on time to school. I was tardy today. So we apologize, but we appreciate everybody being here for this. So today is our Student of the Trimester, Student of the Year Awards. We're also going to be giving perfect attendance and read amount awards. So many, many awards, and we are excited to give them to all of our students. But before we do that, we have a little special performance from our BBS cheerleaders. <laughs> Perfect attendance. 
And the reason why perfect attendance is important is because when you're here at school, you're learning from your teachers. So when you're here at school, you're learning how it's hard to be here every day. Not even I was here every day. I got sick and I had to miss a day. But some of our students didn't miss any days. So we're going to acknowledge first the students that had perfect attendance for the past 60 days during the third trimester. So come on up when I call your name. Perfect attendance. Last trimester, Ms. Chavarria's class, Benito Acosta. From Ms. Naranjo's class, come on up, Jimena Rivera Garcia. Also, Alexis Romero. And Elijah Valenzuela. For Mr. Sanchez's class, there were also two students that had perfect attendance this trimester. Way to go, Mauricio Camacho. And another student that had perfect attendance this trimester. Way to go, Lisa Michelle. Now, this is what's amazing. Because of all these students that are up here, there's actually three that had perfect attendance the entire year. So we're just gonna, they're already up here, so we're just gonna have them stay up here and let's see who had perfect attendance for all 180 days this year. If I call your name, go back over there to get your goodies when I call your name because there's more for you to have there. All right, from Ms. Naranjo's class, perfect attendance all year long. Way to go, Alexis Romero. The next student, perfect attendance all year long from Ms. Naranjo's class. Way to go, Elijah Valenzuela. And lastly, from Mr. Sanchez's class, perfect attendance all year long. Way to go, Lisa Michelle. So again, amazing work for all these students being here every single day ready to learn. Make sure you have your certificate facing forward. Smile for our parents out there and family. All right, let's give them one more big round of applause for our students. For perfect attendance. Awesome job. Keep it up. Amazing weekend. Good job. Good job. All right. Now it's time for, I'm going to call up your teachers next. Okay, I'm going to call up your teachers and they're going to be giving you your readathon medals and awards. If you met your goal for the readathon, if you met your goal, you're going to get a certificate and you're going to get a medal. If you got over 100 points, with which three people in second grade did, they're also going to get a readathon trophy for getting into the 100 point lab. So let's call up these teachers first to come on up and give the awards to their students. The first teacher we want to call up, she is our dual language teacher. She is in room one. Oh, five, let's have a class for Miss Shavaria. The next teacher we want to call up he was a great level lead this year. He's in room two. Oh, one nice round of applause for Mr. Lupin. All right, when I call you up, come on up and get your certificate from your teacher and the medal. We're going to announce those that met their goals first and the trophy winner at the end. All right, for Ms. Chavaria's class, and we're going to announce all the students up from both names, from both classes, I mean. All right, first student to come on up. Way to go, Adriel Beltran Herrera. The next student, awesome job. Way to go, Alejandro Navarez Martinez. The next student, that is goal. Way to go, Oscar Ceballos Aguilera. Another readathon star. Way to go, Alyssa Martinez. Another great reader, way to go, Emily Magania Venegas. Another super reader, way to go, Montserrat Duenas. Another great reader, way to go, Raymond Medina. 
Another great job. Way to go, Nadine Silva. This next dude met her goal, too. Way to go, Hazel Gray Diaz. And her last student that met her goal. Way to go, Ali Gasca Sandala. All right. So like I said, we're going to announce first all the students that met their goal. Now we're going to introduce the student that exceeded their goal and went all the way up to 105 points. So from Mr. Lubin's class, 105 points, a reading star. Way to go, Ali Corona. All right. So all these students, again, did a super job with the readathon. Once they all get their certificates, awards, we'll have the teachers go behind them so we can get a photo. All right, so we'll let our family members take some photos of our reading stars. All right, let's get one more big round of applause. Our students did an awesome job in the read a There you go. Give me a fist pump and go on back to your seat. Good job. Good job. Pick it up, teachers. We'll have you go take a seat too, and then we'll call you back up here in a few minutes for our next awards in just a minute. All right, so thank you for that. All right, we're gonna call our next teachers for the readathon. We're gonna have them come on up. So the first teacher we wanna call up, he has been in second grade for many years. He is over in room two. Oh, for this round of applause for Mr. Sanchez. The next teacher we want to call up, she was a part of our after school tutoring. She is in room two. Oh, two, let's run a class for this. This is no All right, we're going to introduce these students first. All right, here we go. First student just met her goal, did a great job. Way to go, Talia Baye. The next student also met his goal. Way to go, Edgar Acosta. Another great reader. Way to go, Elijah Valenzuela. Another super reader. Way to go, David Mendez. Another great reader. Way to go, Giselle Hernandez. Another great reader meeting her goal. Way to go, Allison Alvor Soto. Another great, awesome reader. Way to go, Nicole Leva Quiroz. Another student that met his goal. Way to go, Samuel Gomez. Another great reader. Way to go, Jimena Rivera Garcia. Another student that met his goal. Way to go, Diego Ruiz. Another great student meeting the goal. Way to go, Eric Zapia. This next student also met her goal. Way to go, Jimena Velez Galindo. All right, these next two students also met their goal and again got to our 100 point club. This first student got to 101 points. Way to go, Jacob Mendoza! We'll give him his award. All right, and the last student in second grade that not only got to 100 points, got over 150 points, got over 170 points with 171 points, the top Reader in the readathon from second grade. Way to go, Lisa Michelle. Some awesome job to our top readers. Amazing work. Again, the readathon is tough because you have to read your stories and then you have to answer comprehension questions at the end to show you knew what you were reading. So excellent job as well. All right. 
We will have the teachers join their students. We'll have the students move down just a little bit so we can get all of our students in there for our photo. All right, great job. Let's give a warm round of applause for our students from these classrooms. Great job reading. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep going. Good reading. Good job. Congratulations. Awesome. Amazing. Good job. And remember this, just because school is coming to a close, we still have reading that we can do in the summer. The Coachella Library has lots of books. I was just over there. I was just at the Coachella Library. They have so many good books over there to read. Ask your mom and dad or family to take you over to the Coachella Library so you can get a book and you can keep reading during the summer. All right, we're going to call up our teachers again to come on up and give their academic, avid, and citizenship awards to their teachers. So again, we're going to call up in room 205 our dual language teacher, Ms. Chavarria. And again, we're going to call up from room 201 our great level lead, Mr. Lewin. All right, here we go. Let's see who our winners are. First ones are going to be trimester winners. Our last ones are going to be our student of the year. So, in academics from Miss Chavaria's class, the first student in academics, way to go, Diego Puente. The next student did an awesome job in academics in all areas as well. Way to go, Ramses Aguilar. The next student did a great job with citizenship, being respectful, responsible, and safe. Way to go, Nat Nat Natalia Valdominos. The next student, again, great citizenship. Way to go, Edin Guzman Cabrera. These next students, Avid, were neat and organized. Way to go, Yareli Tiempo. The next student also did neat, organized work. Way to go, Yadier Rosas. All right, these next students were amazing meerkats all year long in all these areas, so they're going to get a trophy too. This first student academically did an awesome job all year long. Way to go, Natalia Valdovinos. The next student also did a great job with citizenship all year long. Way to go, Angelique Belman Padilla. And the last student of the year from this class did a great job in added, being neat, organized. Way to go, Daniel Gonzalez Sanchez. So again, great work from all these students from Ms. Chavarria's class. As soon as they all get their awards, let Ms. Chavarria join them so that they can get their photo with the paparazzi. All right, again, let's give one more big round of applause for our students from the Starbucks class. Way to go. All right, now it's time for Mr. Lubin's class. Let's see who they are for both trimester and all year long. The first student from Mr. Lubin's class did a great job with academics in all areas this trimester. Way to go, Arnold Toscano. <laughs> the next student also did a great job this trimester. Way to go, Arturo Cota. <laughs> the next student did a great job with citizenship. Way to go, Arisa C. Zamora. <laughs> the next student also did a great job with citizenship. Way to go, Victoria Moreno Aguilar. The next student also did a great job with Avid this trimester. Way to go, Sofia Miranda Deo. And the next Avid student did a great job with 
Abbott, all Prime Minister as well. Way to go, Oscar Ceballos Aguilera. All right, these next students were amazing students all year long in the different areas. First student here in academics. Way to go, Ali Corona. The next student of the year did a great job in citizenship, being respectful, responsible, and safe. Way to go, Emily Magana Manegas. And the last student from Mr. Lewin's class did a great job with added strategies this year. Way to go, Valentina Aguilar Hernandez. So amazing work again to all of these students who worked hard all year long and showcase their skills. So again, we'll have Mr. Lubin join his students as soon as they all get their bling, and then we'll have our photo. All right, great job. One more big round of applause to our students from Mr. Lubin's class. Awesome. All right. We only have two more classes to go. Let's see who they are. Again, let's call up our teachers in room 204. Let's call up Mr. Sanchez. And we'll also call back up from room 202, Mrs. Naranjo. All right, here we go with our first class, Mr. Sanchez class. Let's see who our winners are in academics for this trimester. The student did a great job in academics. Way to go, Micaela Mendoza. The next student also did a great job with academics. Way to go, David Guillen. The next student did a great job with citizenship, being respectful, responsible, and safe. Way to go, Daniel Muro. The next student did a great job with citizenship this trimester. Way to go, Lisa Michelle. The next student did a great job with Abbott being neat and organized. Way to go, Johnny Corrales. The next student also did a great job with Mavin this trimester. Congratulations, Melody Torres. All right, these next three students are Student of the Year winners. Let's see who they are. Remember, if you get this award, make sure that you get all your goodies. The first student in academics all year long in all content areas did an awesome job. Congratulations, Lisa Michelle. The next student also did a great job with citizenship all year long, being a friend to other meerkats and being respectful, responsible, and safe. Way to go, Jimena Velez. The next student also did a great job with avid strategies, neat, organized, very well done throughout the year. Way to go, Micaela Mendoza. Again, congratulations to all of our students up here. While Mr. Sanchez joined them so that they can have a photo. All right, great job. Let's give one more round of applause for our students. Mr. Sanchez, to this one. Go on back to your seat. Amazing job again. All right, we got one more class to go. And that's Mr. Rondo's class. So let's see who our winners are from that class. I can hardly wait. Here we go. First one, Mr. Rondo's class did a great job this trimester in academics. Way to go, Mia Rubio. The next student of the trimester did a great job. Way to go, Elijah Valenzuela. Another super citizen this trimester. Way to go, Talia Bayan. The next student showed great citizenship 
this trimester way to go, Diego Ruiz. The next student is in Miss Naranjo's class, but was recognized also by Mr. Contreras. Way to go, Alexis Romero. The next student did a great job in Abbott Strategies. Way to go, David Mendez. Another super near cat this trimester being eaten and organized with Abbott. Way to go, Edgar Acosta. All right, these are our trimester winners. Let's see who our student of the year are in these areas. First student of the year in academics. In all areas, all year long, way to go, Nicole Hero. The next student of the year in citizenship, both respectful, responsible, and safe, way to go, Jacob Mendoza. And the last student of the year winner in Avid, using three column notes, Using their orange folder, doing a great job. Way to go, Giselle Hernandez. So congratulations to our students from Mr. Rago's class. As soon as all the students come up, we'll have Mr. Rago join our students for our final photo of the morning. Thank you. 